from Mankango in the Salaga district, where some passengers who were on board the Nana Besumuna ferry, which sank on Friday, November 15, have attributed the cause of the accident on the ferry's decaying wooden components. Our Savannah region correspondent Christopher Amwankon reports an operation is expected to be undertaken to salvage the vessel when a team from Akonsombo arrives this evening. The ferry, which sank between Yeji and Makongo on the Volta Lake at about midday on Friday, November 15, had on board three cargo trucks loaded with tubers of yam. A visit to the scene the following day revealed a group of young men of loading the tubers of yam into canoes. Officials from the Salaga Fire Service were also waiting to drain the water from the ferry. The water itself has gone into the, the vehicles. And when you look at the load, we cannot pull them out. So we came out with our own idea and suggesting that we have to advise the captain and his team so that if the public will help us to offload the corn and the yam out of the tracks so that when the, the yam is out then the car become lighter they will then pull it out some of the drivers of the truck who were on board the ferry blamed the situation on the ferry's decaying wooden component this ferry is very old we need a new one a check on the rams confirmed their report. The deck hand of the vessel declined to speak to us. Passengers as well as vehicles were stranded at the birth of the Volta Lake. In 2015, another ferry in Deura sank in a similar situation. We want to get more detail to this particular development in the Savannah region. Let's speak to our Savannah regional correspondent, Christopher Mwakon, for that update. Good to have you, Chris. Now, has the rescue team from Akonsombo arrived, and what is the current situation as we speak? Yes, the rescue team has not um, arrived from uh, Akonsombo as we speak, and the situation is still like that. Uh, people around are taking or removing the yams from these uh, two uh, uh, tracks that are stuck in the water so that the weight will be less for them to be able to pull the tracks out. But have you been able to gather reasons why there's still no rescue team till now? Hello? Have you been able to again? gather reasons why there's still not been any rescue team till now? Yes, um, the, the rescue team is coming all the way from Akosombo, and they left Akosombo um, yesterday around 9 p.m. So uh, we are expecting them that by 9 p.m. they should be at Makango to salvage the situation. Okay, and what what is the fate of the stranded passengers as we speak? Yes, we are stranded there, uh, especially those whose yams are in those tracks and the drivers as well. Uh, as for the other passengers, because of the boat that crosses over to um, Yeji, some of them use the boat, but they are going there to wait for their uh, goods that are stuck in the um, tracks. Okay, Chris, I'm sure uh, we will get back to you again and get more updates when the rescue team comes about. Christopher Amwako is our Savannah regional correspondent today, giving us that update from the Savannah region.